What's up YouTube? In today's video, I'll show you how to create six cute fast food icons in Adobe Illustrator. Here is how we'll set up the layers. Begin by creating the outline using shapes and the pen tool. Use a black stroke with rounded caps and corners to ink the illustration. For the fries, we will use the Shape Builder tool in order to create a custom shape. Make all closed shapes with a black stroke and a white fill. This will allow us to better place the fry shapes. Move on to the sandwich. Start creating the left side and with the reflect tool, copy it to the right. This will allow the icon to remain symmetrical. Next, we will outline the pizza using the same methods. For the slushy, we will use ovals and modify them to create our shapes. For the straw, create a black stroke and make it thicker. Go to the object menu and outline the stroke to create a shape. Using the shape builder tool, clean up all the overlapping lines. For the burger, follow the same steps and methods. Finally, going back to the fries, we will have to use the Shape Builder tool in order to clean up all of the overlapping lines. Select a few fries together and click and drag them to combine the shapes. I'll speed this up as this process can take a minute or two. Great, now let's apply some base colors. I'll show you how to do this with the soda can. Select all and copy it to the color layer. Lock and then hide the outline layer for the moment. 
Select the illustration and press the letter K on your keyboard to activate the Live Paint Bucket tool. Click each individual sections to apply a base color from the color swatches. Once completed, head to the Object menu and select Expand. Ungroup all and delete the black outline. And finally, in the Layers panel, reveal the outline layer. I'll be doing this to the five remaining icons. Finally, let me show you how I add shadows and highlights. Select the shapes and do a copy and paste in front twice. Move the top shape up and resize it. Select the two shapes and activate the Shape Builder tool and delete the unwanted shapes. Make that new shape darker to represent the shadow. Apply lighter color shapes with the pen tool to add some highlights. I'll fast forward the remaining of this video by following the same techniques. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. And there you have it, how to create 6 cute fast food icons in Adobe Illustrator. If you enjoyed these, let me know what kind of icons you would like me to show you next. Thanks for watching, cheers everyone!